Stripping is a dental jargon term that refers to the reduction of dental enamel between the teeth. Physicians call this an AER, or a proximal enamel reduction. Why is the dental enamel reduced in the first place? Well, there can be multiple reasons. For example, in cases of malocclusions, a slight lack of space can be solved, which positively influences the shape of the gingival papilla so that tooth movements are accelerated within the course of orthodontic treatment with a retainer. With an approximal enamel reduction, an AER, the dental enamel is removed with an emery element. In the video, you can see enamel removal with polishing strips or with mechanically driven polishing discs. In the beginning, one always starts with very rough polishing elements, as this results in optimal removal of the enamel and very little heat development. Then, as shown in the animation, one should always use the finer polishing elements because rough enamel is easier for bacteria to hold on to, making it more vulnerable to caries. Thus, smoothing it is extremely important. The loss of dental enamel may make the tooth more vulnerable to caries. This is why very little should be taken off and why the reason for removal should be given careful consideration. In certain retainers, the so-called aligners, you can find out more in the video by the same name, there is often a lot of stripping done in a very careless manner. Although this does lead to appropriate tooth movements, the price is unfortunately dental health. But it's not just the tooth that can be damaged by excessive stripping. If too much of the approximal enamel is removed, that is, the enamel between the teeth, the teeth move so close to one another that no space remains for the bone, as seen in the animation. The consequence is the recession of the bone. You may notice bleeding of the gums, and after a number of months or years, the tooth may unfortunately become loose.